Okay, yesterday we saw that if we try to open a document created in Word 2013 using Studio 2011, we will get this error message here. So I've found a quick and dirty workaround that will let you import such documents. So a docx is basically a zip file. So what I can do, I can change the extension from docx to zip. And now that I have my zip file, I can unzip it to my desktop here. So now I have a, a folder with the same name that I can open. And I can go to this folder here. And there is a file named app.xml. I will open it with Notepad. And at the very end of this file, there is a number 15, which corresponds to the version of Word. So Word 2013 is, in fact, version 15. And I will change this number to 14, which is the version of Word 2010. And now I will save this file and close it. Now I can go back to the previous level. I have all these files here. I will zip them again and they will go to this file here and this file I can rename it to simple document 2 and I will change the extension to docx like this and I will move it back to my desktop. So now I have a modified version of uh, this file and uh, let's see if we can open it in studio. So I will select open document and now I will point to the new version of this file which is simple document 2. Open and OK. And voila, we have a document perfectly imported into Studio 2011. So this is what you can do while waiting for SDL to fix this problem. Uh, this quick uh, workaround will let you import Word documents that were created with the new Word 2013. Thank you for watching, do subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video.